Folks, listen. I just made a reminder about this in my iPhone. But listen, for a large part of today, the power has been out. And sometime, well, during, during part of today when the power was out, I've been kind of thinking what a fool I was to keep cussing and rambling and complaining whenever people talk about something that I hate or dislike. This has not happened today. People have not talked about things that I hate or dislike or that make me want to cuss. Pardon me if I burp. Okay. This, this did not happen today. The day that I made this, people did not talk about things that I dislike or that I hate or that make me want to cuss, talk bad, or act mean or rude, or talk mean or rude. That did not happen today. But today, when the power was out, I was kind of thinking throughout throughout the day, I was kind of thinking, why on earth would I ever want to complain about something that I don't like? Why on earth would I want to complain? Why on earth would I want to cuss or complain about something that I don't like? Especially if I've made that... Especially if I've made that uh, opinion loud and clear. Even if I have cussed or not. We should not do that. Folks... Recently, the other day, I heard something on, on the local news when it came to, well, they were doing a health segment, and on the news they said, people's, people's, well, they said, they said on the news, the part of the brain that controls judgment does not fully develop until, or, until around the age of 25, I turned 25 on the I turned 25 on November 16th 2020 this is this is February of, of 2020 and and like I said on the day that I made this I just realized after I've made my thoughts and opinion of what I dislike or hate clear what's the use of me cussing What's the use of me talking? What's the use of me of me complaining about that thing after I've made my opinion clear to those who are with me and or and or around me? What's the use of doing that also if you're having What's the use of doing that even if you're having a virtual conversation with someone? What's the use of doing that? If what's the use of doing that when you're when you're with people that that know how you feel that know that know what your opinion is and what's of and what is the use of doing that with what is the use of doing that with when you're having a virtual conversation on FaceTime chat or on the phone or things like that what's the use of doing that when you are either with or talking to people who know your opinion of those things there ain't no use uh, in it by the way the reason i just partially repeated myself is because i thought i heard my mom in the other room calling for me so i'm gonna have to repeat myself one more time whenever you are with people or having a virtual conversation with people who know your opinion of those things what is the use of complaining and talking bad or cussing about things that you hate after you have made the opinions clear to the people who you're either having a virtual conversation with or or who are with you over the phone or in person. Once you've made your opinions clear on that, what is the use of talking about it or cussing about it or acting mean once, once the people know how you feel, how you feel 
about those particular things. There is no, there is no use in it. <clears throat> like I said, on the news recently, in the health segment, they said people's brains do not fully develop until until they reach the age of 25. I'm 25. This is the year 2021. This is the month of February. And I turned 25 on November 16th, 2020. That is that is when I turned 25. I'm sorry I'm repeating myself. But once you have made your opinion clear to everybody who, who you're talking to or who are with you, What's the use of cussing or talking or acting mad or mean or having bad behavior under those under those circumstances? There isn't. And I just realized that today. Like I said, the day that I made this, the power was out. And listen, Luke 6 says, Love your enemies, do good to them, and lend to them, and be not concerned. Be not concerned that they might not repay. And Romans 12 says, Beloved, uh, Beloved, uh, Avenge not yourselves. Romans 12 also says, The Lord will, the Lord will get revenge for us. Matthew 7 says, Do unto others as we would have done unto us. Matthew 7 says, Do unto others as we would have done unto us. And Matthew 7 also says, This is the law and the prophets. And it also says, Ask and you shall receive. Matthew 7 also says, Ask and you shall receive. Matthew 6 says, If we forgive those that have sinned against us, we will be forgiven. But if we don't forgive those that have sinned against us, we shall not be forgiven. So folks, really, once we've made our opinions clear of what we hate, dislike, or makes us mad, we should really ask the Lord to help us get in the habit of never talking about it, thinking about it, or complaining about that under any circumstances, unless someone is with us or, or around us or on the phone with us who does not know our clear, our clear thoughts and or and or opinions of what we hate, dislike, or of anything that makes us want to cuss, or or of anything that that is that is disgusting to us, or or that grosses us out. Remember Matthew seven says, Ask and you shall receive and do unto others as you would have done unto you and and Matthew 6 says, if we forgive those that have sinned against us, we'll be forgiven. But if we don't forgive those that have sinned against us, we won't be forgiven. Mark 9 says, all things are possible to those who believe. Philippians 4 says, I can do all things through Christ who strengthens me. Hebrews 13 says, the Lord will never leave us nor forsake us. First John 1 says, if we say that we have no sin, we deceive ourselves and the truth is not in us. But if we confess our sins, the Lord is faithful and just to forgive us our sins and to cleanse us of all unrighteousness. John 8 says, Satan, who is also called the devil, is a liar and the father of lies. Malachi 3 says, the Lord changes not. I hope this helps you. Do not thank me. Only thank the, 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 the Lord. But please Share this and let me know if this helps you in the comments below. Have a wonderful day. And like I said, on the day that I made this video, the power was out part of the day. Thank you.